Well, good morning, YouTube, and welcome to day two at Monterey Car Week. 17 mile drive is right there. We just saw a Pagani Zonda drive by getting filmed along with an F. Oh, someone's calling. Oh, oh, what do we got? What do we got? Porsche, 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 Porsche. Oh, yeah, we saw those last night. Nice. Ah, welcome to Monterey Car Week 2023. So I think the plan is that we're gonna go to uh, Gooding and check out the auction there. We might also go check out some of the other auctions today, but it's not a crazy busy day today. Wednesday's kind of like where it's all ramping up. So everything starts getting busy today and then tomorrow is when the <coughs> hits the fan and it just goes nuts. So stay tuned, like, share, and subscribe and uh, we'll show you some cool stuff today. To tell me where we're going. If you'll just move on your map so you'll see Carmel and then not far from there, you'll start seeing golf course and Pebble Beach. Yeah, well, that's we're that's where we're going. Yeah. Okay. That's where we're going. I've got this. All right. An old Alpha Bad. with the actual. I wonder if that's a stick together or if that's a Oh, look at that thing. Oh, we're at the Maybach building. Yep. Yeah, yeah it's badass. Let's see. Well, we're behind uh, Gooding in the unloading zone and just checking out cars here. I think that's an actual Tessarosa. I love the exhaust coming out of the front like that. It's just unreal. That's sick. Look at the heat exchanger. Oh. <laughs> We got a 575 Super America with the crazy convertible top that literally rotates back and locks into place there. It's also electrochromatic. It's very expensive. Don't want to break those. Oh, it's got a partial front PPF. We're at Gooding and Company, 250 short wheelbase. It's got the Mira. Ooh, that is clean looking. Did you see the 599 SA Aperta? Ooh. <laughs> mm. uh. Wow. One of 80. One to 1 1.3. Oh, even got the carbon fiber headlights. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Ferrari 340 America Berlinetta. <laughs> Look at the windshield wiper in this thing. <laughs> wow. Gorgeous. MC12, sorry. The race version, okay, that's that's a rare bird. Cause they didn't make very many of the MC12s to begin with. I love this car. Jeez, two and a half to three. Look at the carbon fiber through the paint. <laughs> so this is basically a Ferrari Enzo what? A gated Super America? I didn't think they made any. Holy cow. 650 to 800, no wonder. Well, I'll be damned. I didn't think they made any, but I guess they did. 
because they only made like uh, 240 something of these. Maybe it was 300 and something of them. Wow, that's cool as hell. That is super cool. I am so happy to see that they actually made that in a manual. That is really, really cool. Maserati Super Leggera. 3500 GT. I had a friend who had one of these as a kid, but it had a Chevy motor. Oh man, smell it. Oh, it's so cool. <laughs> <laughs> wow. That's serious race right here. RSR Carrera 3.0. Oh, oh my god. Jeez. That's cool as hell. Shelby King Cobra? What the? What is this? I've never heard of this. Look at the batteries just chilling there next to your feet. <laughs> it says a Shelby Cooper T16M King Cobra. 650 to 850,000. I really know nothing about these. Obviously, these are uh, like barn finds, original condition. Sheesh. 1923 Locomobile Model 48. 1921 Stutz Series K Bearcat. Look at the little seat. It's still got burrs on the wheel, on the tire. 1913 Renault Type DP22 slash 24 horsepower. Look at the seats. Unreal. Ooh. One of the oh, interesting. It's actually got the shift pattern, yeah. not the Cavallino. Yeah. Carbon steering wheel too. Has, has oh to be wow! For this car. Carbon steering wheel, carbon buckets. Look at the brakes. Carbon ceramic brakes. I didn't think that was available at that time. I guess it is. Wow, that's a very high option car. What's it say? It's gonna go for three seventy-five to four fifty. That's a bargain. That is sweet. Wow, really, really cool car. 94, 964 Turbo S, 3.6. All right, we got a 67 Ferrari 275 GTB4, 3.2 to 3.75 million. Oh, jeez, absolutely beautiful. And you got the Mira and the blue and gold, the white interior, three and a half to four and a half million. Estimated. Wow. Look at the interior. Unbelievable interior. It's funny, you're walking around and you're like, oh yeah, an F40, of course. Didn't even notice it earlier. Ooh. This one looks to be in really, really clean shape. Wow. Yeah. Three to three point seven five. That's a pretty high end for for F forty. Fry four hundred Super America. Huh. Oh. Wow. Five twelve TR ninety two. It's a pretty late one. You can tell it's got some of the different design cues. Dino three oh eight. It's Whoa. completely redone and it's awesome. <laughs> it's awesome. Look at those seats. All right, that's actually kind of a cool interior. Yeah. It that's that's awesome. <laughs> 308 GT4. How much they want? How much they think? Half a million for a Dino two, 308. It's not a pin and farina car. Dude, you know about these? The 308 Virtue and yeah. Virtue or whatever? It's a fiberglass body. Oh, really? This is all, they made like 20 of them or something. This is a, yeah, $325,000. I don't even want to try and say that word, but yeah, this is all fiberglass. Wow. Really cool seats, too. 72 Dino 246 GT, 
Dude, we need that. Yeah. Dude, I want that. That's your shop van. For the shop van? Hell yeah. See, this thing's amazing. Oh, we need this. That is so cool. Look at this thing. Bugatti Baby 2. <laughs> Porsche 993 GT2. Oh. Yep. That's pretty sick. Good color. Nice dark blue purple. Kind of hard to pin the color. Porsche RS60. Wow. Bugatti. Veyron. Did you see what was right behind you? Daytona. Uh, that's, this, was, this could be my car. Is this a 72? Uh, 73. That is 72. 365 GTD4. How much? 500 to 600. Look at the seats. So I wonder if it's got. Oh, any those seats are so cool. They got like red inserts and black Daytona stripes. That's so cool. What a cool car. Porsche 935. Damn. She's just the size of that wing. Look how low the shifter is. It's like below your legs. BMW M1. Such a strange car. A Porsche 930 slant nose. I'm surprised, only 250 to 300. I thought it'd be more than that. All of the risk of death of a regular 930 in a different body. <laughs> yeah, I bet that was a parachute because it's got a little thing and it pops off and falls out or something. The exhaust pipe sitting out. 53 Studebaker Land Speed Coupe. Look how much. No visibility. That's it. That's all you get. Crazy. That looks like a Corvette front end. It does look like a Corvette. I think it, I think it is. Corvette. They probably just welded yeah, it on. Yeah. Yeah, 328. Oh, Boss 429. Oh, this is one of my dream cars. Oh, yeah. God, I love those cars. What's it going for? 250 to 3, 350. Mm. Yeah. Good God. Yeah, this is the uh, OG car. 1886 Benz Patton Motowagen replica. But that is cool as hell. Look at the flywheel with the counterweights in on it. <laughs> it's so cool. Yeah, look at the belt. So we're walking out to the parking lot to get back in our trusty steed, and lo and behold, the Callaway Arrow Wagon. Woo! What a strange car. All right, YouTube, we are at RM Sotheby's. You can check out some stuff. Got the <laughs> US spec Countach bumpers. All right, we're in Sotheby's and god damn. 9.35. So believe it or not, this is Jocko's friend's car selling it. <laughs> That's funny. But we just ran into him. Yeah, we just ran into him. All right, a Lancia and a Super America. This is Bizzarini. Holy sh**, 959. Damn. Dinos and Acura NSX. NSXT. Oh sh**, RS200. Woo. <laughs> That is awesome. All right, here's what I was looking for is Ferrari Hill. Ferrari 500, 1.2 to 1.6 million for that. I mean, <laughs> oh my God, how'd this poor thing get in this condition? Oh, poor thing. Hey guys, this one's as is. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> Uh, a mil you save a million bucks. Jesus. 
512 BB Competizione. 1 8 to 2 8. How did, how did so many of these cars get in such <laughs> condition? These are barn finds. I know they're barn finds, but like. Oh, oh, yeah, dude. I mean, you know. It's just hard to believe that this many cars were stashed away in barns just rotting to sh. <laughs> So depressing. I think they rolled these just the way they found them. Look, this thing is worth more than this condition. 250 GT Berlinetta Luso. Obviously been tracked and stuff. It's got, is that a sticker or a paint? That's too bad. BBI? It's not an eye. Oh, it's just a BB? Oh, yeah. How is this 200 grand? Fully in good condition, it's only worth like 350. It seems like a bad idea to dump this many in the same auction. You know? Poor things. Jesus. Wow. These poor things. It's hard to believe that I guess they were all just not worth crap back then. I wonder if it comes with the raccoon. We saw one of these, this color nearly for 2.7. Jesus. This one goes two. You gotta be kidding me. I think we should buy the Competizione. That, come on, that would be badass. Yeah. Restore that sh Oh yeah. Can-Am race car. Look at the exhaust on this thing. God, it's a half a mil? Four to five hundred, yep. Jeez, look at those tires. That's a lot of tire. Mazi. Shelby Cobra, one to one point two. F430. 575, CGT, McLaren 12C. A 360. Oh, what are they saying? What? 175. Pretty optimistic on this 360. 275 to 325. What? It's got to be a manual then. Okay, it's a manual. It doesn't even have Daytona seats. Another manual. No, they made 1500 in the 430s. Yeah. It said the US. I'm not saying Ah, they're full of sh <laughs> They're trying to pump up the price. You think they're more than 200 in the US? Dude, look at that. It's even got sticky buttons and sh <laughs> and they want that much. The buttons have already got. Oh, look at, look at the vent right here. Oh. <laughs> look at your side too. Look at that vent. Oh. And they want. 275, they're smoking crack. It's a non Daytona. You get in the car and the buttons are sticky, you're like going. It's got, it's got steelies, it's black, it's got sticky buttons, they're smoking crack. <laughs> <laughs> I can find that car for you for half. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at the red carbon fiber. That's unusual. I wonder if that's all MSO stuff. It looks cool. Wow, even the blade. That's wow, look cool. at the dash. All right, I mean, kudos for an interesting spec. Bespoke Project 8. All right, we got the 550 Barchetta with the sports seats. That's a pretty cool car. Pretty rare. 425 to half a mil. Yeah. That's cool, the 550 Barchetta. That's gotten some weather. Alcantara Dash and stuff, that's cool. Another 550, oh, 575, damn. Another 575 gated car. Aaron's trying to capitalize on the gated cars. 350 to 425. I like the red That is the brightest color I've ever seen on any car. It's like neon, like, work vest green. <laughs> yes. Yeah, the dash is peeling. Oh, it's got some mildewy smell. Oh, that's too bad. Mm. It's got all sorts of stickers from racetracks. Not from off-road. What is this thing? 
Alpine Renault. Got the Aston Martin Zagato with the crazy tail lights. These things are usually into the seven figures. What's it at? Oh, they've come down. They're saying only six to eight. She's got the green carbon fiber. The drip on the numbers. That's so yeah, you get the video of it actually. Got the history of it. Unbelievable. At the F1 reception, uh, was it four years ago or five years ago? They had one of these there. Just sitting there, you're like, holy sh And because it's a Le Mans car, it actually has to have the spare. Is that nuts? These things are like 20 million. Raced in the 1968 24 hours of Le Mans. So this actually was in Le Mans. That's insane. I told you. <laughs> 18 to 20 million. Woo! That is badass though. Look at that. Wow, they got all the Schumacher stuff and a Schumacher F1 car. Dear God. Look at this thing. Mm. Check out all the helmets. That's awesome. Okay. Oh, McLaren Speedtail. F40. Whoa. Look at this stuff. Oh yeah. I mean the only thing that's really cool is this the center seat is cool. Jag C type. 2.8 to 3.4. That's interesting that the one at Good Gooding has a much higher expectation than this one. More miles or less condition or whatever. The 275s just look so so pretty. I know like they're not as valuable as the 250s, but yeah, but it's just clean clean look it's the d-type holy crap four and a half to five and a half million oh my god mozzie 200 si three to three point five what a gorgeous car all right 30 to 40 grand for a little f40 well they had one last year i don't know if it's the same one This right here would be badass. <laughs> Enzo engine. That's gotta be an A12 or an F12. F12. That's actually a V10. Wow. That's insane. Dude, that right there. The 575 Competizione. Or is that a 550 competition? I think it's 550. You gotta look at the front. You got the 599 GTO and one hell of a paint scheme. 750 to 900. Yeah, I would say that paint scheme probably hurts the value. It's a bit too flashy for a GTO. Frisky Convertible Special? <laughs> it's a three wheeler. Slightly better condition than Tavares' P1. <laughs> honestly it's weird because like when these first came out they were incredibly like you know just amazing and now it's kind of like it just kind of blends in it well the other mclarens all look the same so it kind of blends in a bit but that wing when it's tucked in is cool to see the carbon fiber has a blue gold flake in it that is really that's actually pretty cool it is big look how big that thing is it's a huge car you got the the citron oh yeah look at those those things look like couches <laughs> oh yeah only 475 wow oh he's got the carbon wheels Yeah. I don't know, man. This looks pretty sick. It is. It is. It's just different. Yeah. Oh, wow. Look at that. Oh, that's carbon. All right. That was RM Sotheby's. You can see it's a. They got some serious shit. Uh, uh, you have to go around? Or is it closed? No, they're open over there. Damn it. We have to go outside and around. Bowden's. Yeah, dude. These are the guys out of LA. Oh, shit. They yeah. add hundreds of horsepower to everything. That's fucking nice. <laughs> oh, God, that's 
stupid. All right, YouTube, we've been out and about all day. Wrapping up the day, gonna go to dinner in a few minutes here, so I think that's gonna do it for now. That was kind of cool, that Senna. That was a shock. We saw it, we were like, ooh, ooh, ooh follow it. So we did. Uh, anyway, uh, we'll see you tomorrow in the next video, so stay tuned. It's gonna be sweet. Mm -hmm.